John Robin real quick. We have some new faces that some of you may not have met yet. We've got Jacqueline, who's our new Motive social media manager. So we made a post about you the other day and um, we're so grateful to have you on the team and with us tonight. Good to see you. And Sarah Smith over there is like the wonder of all wonders in our corporate office. <laughs> she and Kim keep everything moving forward in Greensboro there. So, <laughs> and you're definitely an overachiever this week because everyone's out but you. So. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm excited for this one. So <laughs> and of course, I don't we, mind. Jackie, our fearless uh, leader that's going to teach us how to become beautiful in 10 minutes or less tonight. <laughs> Hi guys. I'm so excited. It's going to be super fun today. It's definitely a great topic because I, I heard you talking earlier about, and it's so true when you're just like, running around, you know, working, being a mom. And then all of a sudden you're like, oh my gosh, I need to be ready for a Zoom or, you know, a gathering and you don't have time, so. Exactly. Well, yeah, that's what I was thinking when we were, you know, brainstorming about this session. And, you know, there's so many times where like, even I have to, you know, when I'm working or I'm with, with the kids and I'm just super busy and I, I, I have guests coming or I have to go do someone's makeup and I just don't have that much time. And literally I just take five, you know, five minutes, 10 minutes um, to do more of a, you know, sophisticated look. So then I could be presentable for whoever's coming over or wherever I'm going. So it's really fun. Hi everyone. Definitely. Yeah, I'm just and I like the palette we're featuring tonight because it's like everything in one spot. So we'll go through that. It really is a great palette. It has everything. You guys have your palettes ready. It has everything we need for this look. Mm -hmm. Got it. Iconic. <laughs> By the way, our brand new Bezos palette is very similar uh, style. Same packaging, I guess you could say. Yeah, and I just went uh, live for pre-order today. I'm sure you guys have seen all the promotions on Instagram and Facebook, so you can go and snatch yours up. I know it's so pretty. I can't wait. I can't wait to get mine. <laughs> yeah, the payoff in that palette is so pretty. Like the shimmers in it, is, they're phenomenal. Love Some it. purple tones, which is kind of new for us, so... So before we kind of get into everything, um, those of you that are, are viewing on Zoom, we do have a question and answer section. If you have answer or questions, if you have answers, if you have questions about anything that Jackie's going through today with the 10 minute holiday glam, um, be sure to ask your questions there. And then we also have the chat and you guys can kind of chat amongst yourselves a little bit there. Um, we don't always see all the questions there. So if you do have a question, use the question and answer. And then, of course, we have those watching on Facebook live. If you're watching on Facebook, please consider sharing this video because I don't know about all of you ladies, but I love getting as many tips as I can about getting ready fast around the holidays because I'm busy regardless. And then you throw the holidays in there and it's like, I don't have a lot of time, but I still want to really look good. So you can you can help help a sister out by sharing it <laughs> so other people can get the information too. And if you are at home and you're going to join along with us, like, please just go step by step with us. And then at the end, we're going to ask you to share your look on social media, take motives in it. Like we want to see what you did because everyone will look different. Did you ever get, notice that you guys like after we do these, it's like everybody has like yeah. their own kind of flair, even though we're going through the, the same steps. So make sure you share that with all of us. Um, Exciting. We have Hawaii, we have Malaysia, all over the U.S. tuning in. I love oh, cool. it. Also, if you guys are uh, like a deeper to dark uh, complexion, you could follow along using the elements palette as well. Um, because it has great pigmentation also, um, and the payoff is going to be really beautiful. So make sure you have that with you. Definitely. All right. Well, I think we have all of our panelists ready to roll with us. They're all here. And so 
Um, go ahead, Jackie, do your thing. All right. <laughs> all right, guys. First of all, I'm super excited because, you know, to learn how to do your makeup in 10 minutes around the holiday is something that we're all going to definitely cherish. So we're going to start. I'm going to do the makeup first. So you guys are going to watch me for the 10 minutes, okay? That way you could pay attention. You could follow along and see what I'm doing. And then when I finish, I'm going to time you. I have my timer here for 10 minutes. Um, but I'm also going to guide you at the same time. So I'm going to tell you, okay, this is the time where you put your primer on. Let's move on to the eyeshadow. Go ahead and grab your liner um, so we could stay on time because I really want us and I want you to finish in 10 minutes. So this is the challenge, okay? So I'm going to go over the product first. Um, I did said, say this in the past when we did um, the last challenge was a five minute challenge. So you guys are lucky because I'm giving you five more minutes. Um, <laughs> um, you know, when you plan what you're going to do, your makeup will always, you know, you will always have enough time to do what you need to do because you're already prepared. Mm -hmm. So we're going to start with our motives primer. So make sure you have that. We're going to do the iconic palette. So make sure that's the next product on your lineup. Um, then we're gonna do the liner, the Onyx Motives liner. Then, yep, then we're gonna do the mascara. Then we're gonna do the concealer. If you guys have the concealer, we're using the Illuminating Foundation today. Um, then after the foundation, we're gonna do the blush and bronzer from the palette. And we're going to line our lips with the neutral lip liner. And if you guys tuned into our lip session um, a few weeks ago, you'll know it's super important to line our lips. And we're gonna finish off the look with good behavior um, liquid lipstick. So that is, those are our products, okay? That's what we're gonna do. That's what you're gonna see me do for the first 10 minutes. And then it's gonna be your turn, okay? So. I have 10 minutes on my timer. Before you start, huh? you have suggestion on what type of brushes they should have on hand? Yes. Yeah, so if you guys have the motives um, brush, the brush roll, I have all the brushes here on my little cup. So we're going to do, basically, we're going to use all the brushes that are there. So I'll also tell you which brushes we're using, um, what's coming up next. I also have the motive sponge. Um, that I like to use with the foundation. So make sure you have your brushes ready too, because that's going to take time if you're searching for stuff. So make sure it's, you know, at a hand's reach. And, and that's it. So you guys ready to watch me? <laughs> yes, I can't wait. All right. So, wait, hold on. I got to open my primer. Yeah, <laughs> okay. Get everything ready for 20 seconds off. <laughs> Yeah, wait, hold on. Let me open. See, we got to open, open all our stuff. <laughs> yeah. like my, my little like, Let's go, seconds. baby. Okay. I'm telling you, you have to prepare yourself or else what's the point? You know, that, that all those seconds count. All right, here we go. I'm going to press start. Okay, I'm in. So maybe you so, said this, Jackie, but just to reiterate, Jackie's yeah. going to do it first and teach us and then we're all going to go together after that. Exactly. So right now I'm doing the primer. I'm just dabbing it away all over. I just, I like to do a very sheer application, nothing too heavy. This is just good because you're doing it so quickly. You want your makeup to last. So primer is always great to have. Then I'm going to take the Motives eyeshadow brush and I'm going to use the Iconic palette in Queen, which is this shimmery color right here. And I'm going to do this all over my lid. So really quickly. And that's a gorgeous, pretty, like just very neutral color. It's very neutral, but it has like this super pretty shimmer to it. Um, you know, you can tell I like it. Look, it's almost gone. <laughs> I <Mine> too. <laughs> really? Oh my God. Yeah. It has a, such a pretty sparkle to it, you know? Okay, yeah, so fun. now I'm going to go ahead and use the crease brush from Motives. And I'm going to use the star. Uh, star power color which is this really pretty copper color so if you're using the elements palette they have a really pretty red color on it that you can use that one as well 
And I'm gonna do this on the crease. And today's look is gonna be an open contour. So it's just gonna be very pretty, sophisticated. And you're gonna start right at the center of the crease. And we're just gonna move back and forth. And we're just gonna blend the color away. So it's almost like you're doing like a soft, soft smoky right on the crease. And we're gonna stop right at the end here because we want our eye to look open and big. So I'm gonna do the other side. And it's literally back and forth. So what happens when you use this motion, you're really um, making sure that the product is gonna adhere to the primer and it's gonna last longer. So make sure you go back and forth and just blend it really, 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 you know, smoothly. And Jackie, if you have a, um, like, a, like a disappearing lid, you're still gonna use that technique? So if you have a disappearing uh, lid, what you need to use is a flatter brush, like a concealer okay. brush. And what you do is you create the shape. Okay. But yes, definitely create that contour and then okay. you know try to blend it. So now I'm moving on to the um, liner. So what I'm gonna do is I like to create like little lines really close to my lash uh, line. And then what that's going to do is it's going to guide me. So then I could go ahead and quickly just fill it in a bit. And then I'm going to take the Motive Lip Liner Brush. And I'm just going to smudge it. We're not going to do a hard line today. We're just going to smudge. And I'm just going to, you know, just make it smooth towards the end, OK? We're gonna do the same thing on the next one. And I have six minutes left, so that's a long time for me. And then we're gonna do, again, the motive slip brush. And we're just gonna smooth out that line, okay? It doesn't have to be perfect. It's just, it's almost like a smoky, like soft, neutral line. And I like to pull a little bit at the end, so it just looks a little bit more, um, you know, like just more uh, like pointier at the end, but nothing too, too much, okay? Now I'm gonna do the mascara. Let me just grab my mirror. And you could go ahead and do a few coats, you know? I, I, I do so many coats of mascara, I don't even know. I do like 20, 30 coats. People are like, oh, you could do two or three. No, just, do as many coats as you want, you know, within your 10 minutes, because that's going to help with, uh, you know, making, giving you the illusion that you have false eyelashes. So like, even right now, you could start seeing that my lashes are looking longer. And like, if I have, you know, some kind of lash on. You can totally. Uh, fiber <laughs> I mean, the fibers and the mascara is amazing. Yeah. So that's, definitely I'm have fun. That. <laughs> have fun with building, you know, just build, 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 and you'll achieve that um, false, false lash effect. And for those of you watching, the Fiber Lush is on sale. I was just going to say that, Lee. Oh my gosh, it's so funny. <laughs> so I have five minutes now, and I'm moving on to concealer. So we're just, I, I like to do the little dots because mm -hmm. it just, it's a cute guide for me. And I take the, uh, the sponge and I just like to press it into the skin. I'm not swiping, you're pressing because what you wanna do is you wanna make sure that the product stays on your skin and you're not removing it. Cause a lot of women do that. You know, they put on product and then they're like swiping it and you're literally taking it off. Okay. So what you wanna do is just press it, push it onto the skin and blend it. So now I'm gonna take the illuminating foundation. I have four minutes, guys. And Plenty I'm swabbing. And I like to start from the center out and I'm pressing outwards. You know, just everywhere. Don't forget your left lines underneath your nose. Um, that's like the biggest part as a makeup artist that I could tell people didn't blend well <laughs> when you look at their nose. So make sure you do that. And of course, your forehead. Okay. Don't forget to blend down your neck. Okay. 
you can see your lips, so it's everything stays neutral. Okay, so now I'm gonna take the palette again, which is amazing because it has the bronzer and the uh, blush. So I'm gonna take the bronzer and I'm gonna do a little bit on my forehead. I'm gonna go down to give myself like that contour illusion. But the palette also has this pretty legend color that could be a pretty contour for more of a fair skin. So I'm gonna do the same on the other side. I mean, like, honestly, this palette is so versatile. It has really everything you need in it. It has, it has four lip colors. It has blush, it has bronzer. It has, you know, eight eyeshadows. And it's just such a great palette that you could gift, um, especially for the holidays now. And so I'm taking the same brush guys and I'm gonna do the pink color. I like to smile and in circular motions, just pop it in there. I'm like, I'm using my computer as my mirror guys. So. <laughs> well, it's you looking me. good. Okay, good. And you're already glowy. <laughs> yeah, it's such a pretty color. All right, we're gonna do the lips. So if you guys, you know, watch the lip episode, I like to start from the center and I like to do the back and forth motion to really get into those little lines that we have in, on our lips. And then I like to do the bottom. I like to underline my lip just to make it look a little bigger. And then just go for it. Now with liquid lipsticks, you don't really have to line, but I like to line because I like to use it as a guide, you know? because it's already, you know, lined up. And so this color is so pretty. And let me see how much minute I have one minute and 30 seconds. Looks gorgeous. And that's one of our new liquid lipsticks and good behavior. I'm in love with that color. Yeah, I was gonna say that's definitely a top seller. I don't know if we have any watchers from Taiwan on tonight or their morning, um, but they've been selling out of a ton of the liquid lipsticks and glazes. So. so guys, I have one minute and 11 seconds and I'm pretty much done. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm just gonna go in and I'm gonna do the bottom eye just to dress it up a little more, right? And then I'm gonna do a little mascara and we're done. And you could even, you have time to set your makeup with our 10 years younger setting spray if you wanted to even. Exactly, so I have 43 seconds. Now my heart is like beating really fast. <laughs> the lip liner you guys is neutral. Look at mine, yes. it's like tiny. <laughs> yes, the neutral. All right, I'm, I'm actually putting a little bit of whatever I had left over on my eyeshadow brush on the bottom just to kind of smudge the liner. And I have 25 seconds. So I'm gonna take that time to shake my <laughs> setting spray. And it looks beautiful. We're done. It's like a glam look too. In yeah, it's, I love it. a, a pretty love it. quick look. You have 10 minutes. This is not like a full on stage makeup, but look, this is gonna work if you're busy doing a turkey and you gotta go open the door, <laughs> give yourself 10 minutes. There you go. That's exactly it. It's like, you know, stuff in the oven, you're trying to set the table, do all this. I mean, we're all multitaskers, but we can still put a little makeup on and look holiday ready. I love it. Exactly. So, you know, I didn't do anything to my eyebrows. Of course, I, you know, I had a minute left over. So I, I usually, I'm pretty simple with my brows. I like to just brush them and maybe put a gel. But if you need to fill them in, if you follow the steps and I'm gonna guide you guys, you could, you could have a minute or two to do extra things, okay? Well, and you could even so, use one of these um, neutral colors for your brows too, depending on the brow shade. Exactly, so yeah, you could use exactly the brown colors if you need to fill it in. Um, but guess what? It's your turn. You ready? Anyone have any questions before we start? Yeah. Okay, no. so let me- up ready your brushes, your products. <laughs> yeah, so make sure you have the primer lined up. Make sure you have your palette, the iconic palette. Make sure you have your pencils are opened and sharpened and ready to go. Um, your mascara is next. Then we're gonna do the concealer the foundation, 
And um, we're gonna do the, the blush and the bronzer. And then at the end, we're gonna do the lips. So make sure you have it lined up in that order. And I'm gonna get the timer ready for you. So are we doing this at our own pace? Or are you gonna, you're gonna kind of guide no. us? No, so I'm gonna start the timer. Okay, because I timed myself and I need to yeah, time. Jackie's it like, um, you don't get unlimited time. You get <laughs> She's like, I've got the timer ready. <laughs> See, we're not special, okay? <laughs> All right, so are you guys ready? Yeah. Yeah. If I can improvise, like I don't have the concealer, I can use like my quad if I want or whatever, right? Yes. Yeah, as long as you that? have some kind of product that I'm, I'm mentioning in the same okay. category. Oh, yeah. yeah. Improvising. Okay. It's all good. Yeah. All right, okay. so I'm going to press start. Are you guys ready? I think ready. so. All right. Start. So we're going to do the primer. Make sure you do the primer all over your eyelid. We're using the Motives Primer, which is a great product to put on your eyelids. Um, also, if you need to cancel out any redness on your lips for lipstick or colors, that's a good tip. Um, make sure you blend both eyes really well. And at this time, you could start grabbing your brush and you're gonna do the color Queen from the Iconic palette. Um, this color is beautiful. This color has a beautiful shimmer and this color works on everyone really, really, really beautifully. Um, this color we're gonna do from the lash line all the way up to the brow bone, okay? And you could use that same brush. Go ahead and do your other eye. You have nine minutes. Um, and just, you know, tap it away all over your lid. By now, if you wanna start using the Star Power color, which is a really pretty bronzy color, and we're gonna do it only on the crease, and you're gonna use your Motives Crease Brush. And you're gonna go back and forth in like a swish, swash motion, back and forth. <laughs> um, and at this time, try to move on to the next eye. Make sure you have the color and you're blending it really well. You guys are doing good. All right. So now we're gonna move on to the Onyx pencil and you're gonna do a very small line, very close to your lash line, okay? You could do both I eyes. I didn't understand that. My Google. My Google. <laughs> Um, really, really close to your lash line. You. She doesn't want to play. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and then so what I did, guys, is I grabbed the lip um, brush, and what I did, I, I just went back and forth to smudge that line. It doesn't have to be perfect. You just smudge it in between your lashes. Make sure you know it's nice and soft. It doesn't have to be too heavy. It's just kind of giving you a definition of the eye. You have seven minutes and 30 seconds, so we have a lot of time. So if you wanna start working on your next eye, and then the next product is gonna be the mascara. So like I was telling you guys before, the mascara is great because you could build it and you could do lots of coats and it could definitely give you like a false eyelash effect. Um, so start grabbing your mascaras, girls, because you have seven, yeah, seven minutes. And I wanna make sure that we finish with like at least a minute so you could go in and fix anything that you wanna fix. All right, Natalie, look at you. I love that. So now grab your mascara and start doing your mascara um, on both, yep, on both eyes. So just go for it, do as much as you want. Very good. Now this mascara has fibers, so it's gonna build your lashes and it's gonna give you that beautiful uh, false lash effect that we all want, right? Because let's face it, it's not easy putting lashes on. <laughs> and you should change your mascara probably more often than you guys are. Yeah, definitely do it at least every two months just, just to have fresh mascara all the time. All right, so now we're gonna grab our Motives Concealer. You're gonna do three dots and you're gonna grab your Motives uh, sponge and you're just gonna press it onto the skin. This is gonna help 
um, really blend the product onto your skin and take away any dark circles or anything. So if you're using the concealer, that's great. If you're using the foundation sticks, that's even better. They're my favorite. <laughs> And move on to your foundation. So I was using the illuminating powder. You have five minutes and 30 seconds. So go ahead and blend away with your sponge. I love sponges because I feel like they really help to keep the product onto your skin and they really nicely. Sometimes brushes can leave you like stripes. Um, so if you use a, a sponge, it just helps to make everything super smooth. Very cool. We're almost there, guys. And it helps to have a little bit of dampness on the sponge, right? Like you can spray it with your 10 yeah. years younger if you have it. Exactly. You could spray it with your setting spray. It'll actually make it last even longer. But if you wet it, it's fine. It just really blends beautifully. Um, so at this point, guys, I want you to use your flat top foundation brush if you have it or any blush brush or or you know, contouring brush is fine. And we're gonna use the Unbreakable Color from the Iconic palette. So this product, we're gonna use it as a pretty like bronzer glowy powder. So you're gonna do it on the top of your forehead like a number three, going underneath your cheekbones and underneath your jawline. Okay, and then you're gonna do the other side as well. And with the same brush, you're gonna go ahead and we're gonna do the Untouchable blush. And what I love about this color is that it just gives you a really pretty glow. It's not so, so pink. It just gives you like that healthy glow. I love that you can use the same brush. same brush too. It's nice that, you know. Yeah, you could, I use the same brush for both things. So it's totally fine. So at this time, guys, go ahead and use your blush. You have three minutes left. Okay. Looking and good. Now we're going to move on to our lips. So if you could grab your lip liner and start lining your lip. I like to start from the center and I like to move back and forth to really get in between all those little lines that we have that we can't see. And that's going to help hold our lip color. Um, then I like to do the center and then you can line going up, up or down, depending on what shape you want to give your lips. And then we're gonna add the Good Behavior Liquid Lipstick, which is a great color, it looks good on everyone. And it really lasts. I love this product. So I see you guys, you're putting your lips. You have two minutes. There we go. I love it. So you guys, I'm so proud of you. You're pretty much finished and you finished at about two minutes and 30 seconds. So now you could go ahead and take, um, if you wanna do the onyx liner like I did, just to reinforce the bottom eye. Um, if you wanna put mascara on the bottom lashes, these are two minutes to do touch-ups to perfect anything that you missed you could take advantage of these two minutes. I like to take either Powerhouse or Immortal and put that on the brush and just kind of swipe a little bit underneath too. Yeah, Immortal is a really great color. It's like this beautiful black and it has like this gold, like sparkle um, glitter. It's like silver actually. And it's really, really pretty. That's, that, that'll be a beautiful smoky eye. Yeah, at this point, guys, you're at one minute and 45 seconds. Done. And I can tell like you guys are done. Like you guys are just touching up and just like perfecting little things here and there. But this goes to show you that you could do your makeup in under 10 minutes and look beautiful. And you're ready to like host your party without being stressed out or taking hours trying to do your makeup and you still look great. We had a good teacher that definitely helps. <laughs> sitting here thinking like oh it actually is so like usually I listen to a podcast or something when I'm getting ready but I'm like it's so nice having someone like tell you <laughs> what to do do this product you guys still have one minute That's this is amazing. amazing 
I will say too, I, it totally depends on the quality of the product. And because of our products having pigmentation and, and doing what they're supposed to do, you can work super quick. If you don't have high quality products, then that's when you're like taking a lot of time and you're putting like 17 layers on, you know? Yeah, um, you have 45 seconds enough. left, guys. And you, you still have so much time. Like if you wanted to perfect the liner, if you wanted to like really get into your lips and make them bigger, you still have 33 seconds to go. Like, and like I said, this goes to show that, you know, you could take your time and, and do your makeup, but you don't have to take hours. You know, we just did this in less than 10 minutes. Yeah, and Ellen, you're know, rocking that red lip, girl. <laughs> so what's everyone got going on? It looks like Natalie, I like that. Is it like a different, almost like an orangey red maybe? Everyone has like a little bit of a different maybe. Shade. Nine seconds. Oh, is that Bernice one? is getting in with her lashes. All right, one wow. second, guys. <laughs> I love it. All right, we did it. Whoop, whoop. Yay! <laughs> Ten minute challenge, guys. And this is such, you guys look so beautiful. Like, I could see, like, Jessica, Natalie, LaShawn. You know, there's two Jessicas. I could see you both Ellen, Lisa, <laughs> Bernice. You all look so, so beautiful. I'm so proud of you because. <laughs> You know, these challenges, like, I'm not going to lie. I always get a little nervous because I'm like, oh, my God, what if I can't do it in 10 minutes? I'm telling all these girls to do it. <laughs> um, but you know what? We all did it together. And it just goes to show, like, if you prepare yourself in advance, if you know what products you're going to use, you could do your makeup really quickly and look beautiful. Yeah. And one thing I want to point out, too, is, like, isn't this is fun to do, like, a challenge and it's fun with friends. So, you guys could totally schedule something like this with your customers over the next couple of days and help them get ready for the holidays so yeah. that, you know, like, again, just having someone sort of coach you and walk through the steps with you. We always learn something new for sure. Exactly. Like just what I did when you guys were doing it, just talking about the product and telling them why the product is so great and mm -hmm. guiding them through the steps. It's going to make your customer feel so catered to and it's like a different experience it's like so elevated and it's fun and then at the end you know you want to you want to buy whatever you say because you know you help them achieve that look that looks so pretty yeah. so i'm so proud of you guys good job and for I those love of you too that want to have like a little gloss you could use one of the glosses that are in this palette and put that on. And I know um, I even saw Ivy gave a tip, like you can put a little gloss, you know, on your cheeks to get a little glow. Like, yeah, this is just like basic and 10 minute, but you can go outside the box and beyond that. But you guys, this palette, like I've used mine a lot, so don't judge it, but look at and it's, <laughs> it. It's magnetic and it, it's a little cube. So I just like throw this in my makeup bag. Um, that's why it's so beat up, but it's so, durable like nothing has yeah. yeah what I love about this challenge today is that all the products that we use that that I guide you through they're all great products to just throw in your makeup bag when you travel because you have everything in one kit right and then you have your liner your mascara your concealer your foundation and it's literally like six or seven products and that fits perfectly in a little makeup bag and you could go you know, you don't need to bring all these, all this makeup. This is like the perfect kit, like personal makeup stash, right? So that's why I loved it. And, and it's just so great now for the holidays. Like, you know, Lee was saying, you could throw this in a stocking stuffer. Or you could give yeah. this, you know, to whoever, you know, you, you want them to feel like you, like you, they have everything in their hands. And like who wouldn't want this? <laughs> so if you have those like hard to buy for people, like this is perfect. And um, I know uh, Christine has been putting the links, you know, to this. I mean, you guys, like, we have so many great gift ideas, and I don't even know how long I've had this, and look how long it lasts, too. So you get a lot for for the value of this. So I, I love it. I know I've probably used every color, and it's neutral, too, so it's not that scary. Like, it looks good on all different skin tones and, you know, hair color, eye color. It doesn't matter. Um, it's it's amazing. Yeah, it's beautiful. 
It is beautiful. And just get creative. Like you can do things many times. What I'll do with a lot of my business partners is we may, um, you know, pre-sell a product. So we'll do uh, pick a night every week. Like we do Monday beauty lounges here as a group, but maybe pick and do Thursday nights or Saturday mornings or whenever you want to do it. But I think consistency is key and schedule a time to gather. And for my customers, I might pick like a product a week as a focus. And if they buy it, then they get an invitation for a tutorial or a workshop like we did tonight. And I'm going to, they're going to buy it. It's going to be drop shipped to them. I, it's hands off for me. They're going to have it and we're going to do it together just like we did tonight. And if they want to do their own variation, like we did tonight with whatever lip product they have, they can. So, you know, just our whole goal in this is just to, to have some time together each week to chat with you, to inspire you, to have some ideas on how you can service your customers, how you can grow your business. Um, and they're all invited to these sessions. Like we're doing this for anyone that wants to uh, learn. So even if you didn't have the products yet tonight, now you know all about them. You can go ahead and order them. The name of the palette again is Iconic. So I know a lot of you keep asking. It says Iconic right on the front. This was, uh, you know, we launched it with Lauren. Uh, she she had a cool video too that you can share with people on our YouTube channel. Yeah, it was like for maybe our 25th anniversary as a company. And it was yes. Sarah and the, the Motives team did to sort of honor her. And I don't know if you want to elaborate on that, Sarah, but it's, it's neat that, you know, there's one to sort of honor Lauren, which is like your classic everyday go-tos to glam that says, hello, gorgeous. I use mine a lot too. Like we said, it's don't judge me. It's used. Um, but it is one of my favorites. And then the Talia one is a similar, um, packaging with colors that inspire her. So it's kind of cool that we can emotionally connect with our mentors in beauty through the palette too. So did you want to add that? shows you too, like how cool this palette is because Talia, when she, we were working on her new palette, she came to us and was like, I want the iconic palette. I want my palette to look just like that. So it caught her eye and she absolutely loves this palette. So that's why she wanted to recreate it for her. Anywhere. Yeah. You can yep. take this anywhere and it's, it has everything you need. That's why I was saying like, you just need your mascara, your liner and you're good to go because it has lips. You know, it has blush, it has everything. So I'm just happy I was able to do this challenge with you guys using yeah. this iconic. Yes, thank palette. you. <laughs> Hi, Sochi. Thanks for joining us. Thank you so much. Thank and you. next week, you guys, we have like such a fun session planned. Do you want to just tell everybody who we're going to have on next week, Lisa? Yeah, so we're doing a men's edition for a week from tonight. <laughs> Uh, so that's Cyber Monday. So women, you can shop all day and then hop on and invite your guy to join you. Um, and we're going to have Christina Lempesis, who's an esthetician and a makeup artist, talk through step by step what men should be doing to care for their skin and explaining the proper steps and when to use the product. But we thought it would be so fun for all of you as an audience and our community to have your executive sales team from Market America and shop.com as the panelists. So we have confirmed Dennis Franks, Jim Winkler, Andrew Chi, Andrew Weissman, and also Mark Ashley, which we're super excited about. And I think we'll have some more special guests, but that's who I have confirmed so far. Uh, so you're the first to know we didn't even get promotions out yet, but you're going to see all of them just like you're seeing us tonight. They're going to have their video on. They're going to be applying stuff. They're going to be talking to you so you can bring your questions. You get to kind of see them in a more casual setting, which I, I think is really fun. That's why people like reality TV, right? They just want to kind of see people in a natural state. Uh, so help us spread the word and promote that. And you know, men's skin is so different than women's skin. And we have a line, you know, curated just for them. And uh, Sarah, I don't know if you want to even tease on some new products that we're launching that'll be on pre-sale too, um, or anything else you want to add? Yeah, definitely. Um, so we're going to be talking a little bit about our new men's face scrub that we are launching. Um, it's going to go on pre-order soon. And then also our toner pads, which I think 
us women are going to be stealing from our men, yeah. both the scrub <laughs> and the pads. <laughs> the scrub is like one of my favorite new products. I absolutely love it. And I know it's something we kind of don't have in the women's line. So I know you guys are going to love it. It smells so good. It's like a pretty mint green color. Um, and it just feels good. And I feel so refreshed after I use it. So I know you guys are going to be so excited about it. So <laughs> yeah, we'll be talking about the new goodies. Yes. So you'll get a sneaky peek and we'll tell you how to get access to pre-order those so that you make sure you get it before anybody else. Um, so it's going to be a lot of fun. And I hope you all join us and invite people. You know, Dorothy, someone was asking earlier about oh, can I invite my clients from my salon or whatever she was saying? Yeah, you can invite. And that's what this is for. It's for anyone to join. Um, and like we said, we hope it inspires you to host your own as well. So, so they're at the, they're every Monday at the same time. So for those of you asking, so depending on where you live, you know, in the world or the country, it's the same time as tonight. And if you registered for tonight on Zoom, it's the same registration. So you'll get an automatic reminder email. You can just join with that. And then the following week, we are going to have Jackie back and she's going to be going over how you can contour, highlight, and use blush with our new palettes that were launched today. So Jackie, do you want to just let everybody know what you're going to be going yes. over? So I'm so excited for that session because we're only going to concentrate on our face shapes. And I'm actually going to show you different uh, face charts and how to contour that face shape. And, um, and we're going to just use the new products and really like glam it up and it's going to be super fun. So, but I think it's more educational. I'll, I'm going to be showing you, you could do it with me, but we're going to talk about face shapes and how to contour and highlight. Cause I know there's a lot of women who, you know, they don't know what their face shape is. They don't know how to contour it or highlight it. So this is going to be a, a good opportunity for you guys to learn that and, and understand um, the contouring and the highlighting and, and applying blush. So it's going to be super fun. Yes. Yeah, and so those palettes work. just went live today, I think, right, Lee, on the website. And so, yeah, they yeah. are available. So those of you that pre-ordered they're going to be on the way, but you can now go on and order them live and they'll be shipped out as soon as they process your order. And I'm super excited to see that because I haven't even seen the palettes yet in person. So I can't wait to get my hands on them. But we were talking today about how it's so fun to like layer the blushes together and, you know, learn like where to place that highlight versus your blush and versus the contour and, right. you know, how to kind of chisel out your your jawline a little bit, oh. you know, how to, how to contour for your face shape. And I think that it's so easy to use these because they blend so well because it is a powder. So like, no matter what, you know, if you, if you've done it or not before, you can do it with these palettes. So exactly. I'm excited to have Jackie show us, you know, how to use them. So make sure that yeah. you're using them now so that you can have them and follow along with us. Because I find that I learn better if I do it at the same time, like I retain that information. So yeah, it's fun to watch, but it's even more fun to join in with us. And uh, exactly. those of you um, that are going to join, you know, you could be upgraded as a panelist and, you know, have, have fun with us that way too. Yeah, wow. and it's great because not only will you learn how to contour the face shape, but you could also understand that you could use cream products versus powder and then you could apply your foundation sticks and then seal everything with you know the new products that we're going to use and that's going to make your obviously your makeup stand out more and last longer so it's just great to learn and to understand different face shapes so that's going to be super fun love it I saw a comment asking about what pro what palettes we're talking about. So we're referring to the Get Cheeky <laughs> Cheek Palette, the That Glow Though Highlight Palette, and the Shape Up Contour Palette. So those are the three that we're talking about. And I'm not sure country-wise where that specific question came from, but not all the markets did take all of the palettes, but a few did. And you can always look on Global if you want to want to order it. So. Yeah, so Perfect. just go on your Motives website. Um, our team does a great job with that homepage. Anything new that's coming out, the beauty lounges, they do a special landing page for where everything's organized in one spot. So that's like walking into your makeup studio every day. You know, we have a virtual business, not a physical one, which is great for so many reasons. But, you know, if you are partnered with us, make sure you're taking time to go on the customer-centric site so you know what's on there and 
and uh, what's new and what's exciting. And of course it's in our back office too. And yeah. I love the names of them that glow though, get cheeky. I mean, they're asking, oh yeah, there you go. And shape up. Um, so they're right. They should be right on the homepage. We also have a new landing page with all of our holiday specials on it. So we've got a lot going on on our website and a lot of new and exciting new launches. I'm updating my makeup bag. Time to throw some old stuff out. I hope all of you are doing that too. And then of course, helping all of your friends and customers, um, you know, achieve these looks too. Like this is such an easy thing. You can just teach anybody how to do. And so thank you so much for being here again with us, Jackie. I can't oh, I love to, with you guys. To try this again and time myself to see if I can still do it in 10 minutes. And, and don't forget to take your selfies after this. You know, you guys got all glammed up. I would love to see it on social so I can feature all of you beautiful ladies. Yes. Um, sure. And Definitely. then we can see all of you guys too and, and see it, you know, all done up. So make sure to tag motives on Instagram, Facebook. Um, so Jacqueline can reshare those too. So Thank you so much, everybody. And I'll see you guys, you guys all next week. Good night. Thank, Thank you. you.